how you doing welcome to another video this is the the first video i've done now since we're up in Arin Sal. i'll just give you a little bit of a, a tour around where we are it's a bit cold up here so it's still ice up on the mountains here but it's absolutely lovely we've been here uh, a few days and uh, just really tired uh, everything that's happened has been amazing you know just uh making the trip doing all the planning um, you know we said at the beginning of this trip that we wanted to enjoy the planning and the driving and the moving and the packing and everything that we could you know because it's all part of of the of the of the new journey you know it's all part of the process it's all part of living you know so it's just nice to be able to do that but having said that it's tiring you know just getting out of habit in so many different areas in your life um, and I think it really is something that I haven't felt as tired um, since I stopped drinking alcohol uh, even more tired I think because um, when you stop drinking there's so many different changes that you're making in your life there's so many different um, mindsets that you've got to change there's so many different avenues of your own life that you have to change um, and yeah it makes a makes a big difference but it's just like this journey for us up to Andorra, um, it really is making uh, a huge difference in our lives in terms of our um, overall enjoyment of life, you know, what we can do in life, how we can, you know, what, what's the next step to do in our lives. I think that's important for us to do, you know, just to be out with, with the boys, you know, to take them on a, on a different journey. Really nice. Um, but there's so many different avenues that have opened up for us uh, because we stopped drinking alcohol. And I think that's one of the, the things to push through with. That once you do get to a certain point and, you know, if you feel like giving it up on stopping drinking, don't, you know, continue on with it because um, it will really give you uh, lots of benefits. You notice the benefits more in the long term than you do in the short term. You know, we've been here for a week and I'm still knackered, you know, but... Um, that's because you know we're moving everything in we're unpacking boxes we're trying to shift around things we're trying to figure out where everything is um, not only inside the, the the apartment but in the new country uh, we're trying to figure out new rules and regulations like for instance one of the things that um, we don't have up here is the simple thing for YouTube where you can um, I think it was eleven dollars a month or something um, what you can do is put a YouTube video on close down your, your your phone and then put the uh, phone in your pocket and you still listen to the YouTube. I can't do that up here for some reason. I don't know why. Something to do with the geographics of it. So I can't do it in Andorra. But it's a simple thing, but it's simple things like that that tire you out because you're having to figure out those things. And like I said, it's the same thing with stopping drinking. You're always going to have this. It's going to have that same... Um, refiguring out things figuring out things and refiguring out and yeah anyway i just thought i'd do a quick video just to show you a bit of where we are um just to show you that yeah what you can achieve i mean we moved to spain in 2011 but it was a deliberate proposal that we did uh, in 2012 i stopped drinking alcohol i decided to stop 2013 in january i stopped uh, and then it's been uphill uh, in terms of moving upwards in life from that point, so...